when a man gets to the level where he has worked with God enough to earn uh, to become a patriarch not by age but by rank you know some of you think and I want to correct some of you some of you think that by rank we are equal before God no as children of God we are equal but by rank we are different that's why the prophet Joel say each marched in their own rank this is the prophet Joel he said every one of them marched in their own rank do you know what that means it means that we all have equal privileges before God we all are children of God and we are all equal before God but some of us choose permissible will others choose perfect you can choose to serve God you can choose not to serve God you're still a child of God he loves all of you do you understand what I'm saying but there are things that accompany salvation Paul says and of these things thus we speak and when you go now in the next verses he speaks of how God is not unfaithful to forget the labors he knows everything you do in the church a person who just comes to church and enjoys service and goes back home cannot be equal to the person who comes and cleans this church and goes home they are two different people do you understand? Because one is a servant, a born servant. Paul uses the word born servant because we are not forced to serve God. Are you following what I'm saying? We are not forced to serve God. But don't be mistaken. God looks at those who serve him differently. It doesn't mean he loves them more, but he looks at them differently. The Bible says he honors his servants. He honors his servants. He tells you in the church, esteem them that serve in the work of the Lord. And the Bible says, deal with them in double honor. What does that mean? That doesn't mean you shouldn't honor everyone, but honor those among you which serve God. The Bible says, deal with them in double honor. Why does God say deal with them in double honor? Because they serve God. And you don't need to be on the pulpit to be a servant of God. Some of you give, some of you intercede. Whatever you do, but find something to do in the kingdom. It might not be here, you might not be a musician, but walk to the pastor and tell him, give me something to do. Where can we help? Some of you work hard and give your monies to allow the ministry to grow. God bless you. That's service too, because you've committed your hours and gotten that money that is paid to you and brought it in the hand of the pastors so they should preach the gospel efficiently. That's the gospel. That's serving God too. But whatever you do, everybody, I'm telling people in my ministry, every one of us is a servant of God. Praise the Lord. We grow you, disciple you. When you're out of discipleship, we all go because he told us go ye into the world. Now, rankings, like I said, some, some of us must understand that it's like faith. When you got born again, we were all given the same measure of faith, isn't it? The Bible says it's according to all men, the same measure of faith. But some people grow their faith, some don't. You understand what I'm saying? I can easily make a lame man walk and open a blind eye. I can do two tumors. This week I saw two crippled men walking when I was preaching. I didn't pray for them. They just walked. You see, that doesn't mean that I'm different from you. The only difference is that I am growing my faith. Some of you, you have faith, but you're not doing anything to grow it. That helps to rank me. You know when the demons come to the sun, were they the sons of Skeva when they were trying to rebuke devils? They said, Paul, we know. That's a rank. Peter, we know. But who are you? You understand? Refuse for the devil to know, to ask who are you. No, but, oh, 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 oh. You walk around the street and the devil knows that that woman, she's dangerous. That one is dangerous. Let me tell you, hell marks us. It knows who is dangerous and who isn't. Even the demons in hell talk and say, ah, Pastor Lincoln, nah, yeah, yeah, you're in trouble. You understand? And then there are those when they say, uh, la, la, la. Ah, don't worry, that one. She, she just eats sweet chocolate, that's all. <laughs> Praise the Lord. 
Let us grow in the name of Jesus.